today's service yes we are so excited again for this it's so nice spending time with you in your living room it is yes. wherever you are close your eyes let's pray amen heavenly father we thank you for having kept us safe thank you that we can be together again the service lord yes. thank you for the glory and your grace and we pray that it be a blessed day in the mighty name of jesus amen can i get an amen? amen amen are you guys ready we are going to do praise and worship and it is gonna be fun let me see your moves see your boogie boogie hey. so hungry okay i've got this nice piece of bread yes can you hold that for me okay and then i've got a moldy piece of bread it's, it's a bit moldy but it should be fine ah uh, no what do you mean no you cannot be put a piece of molded bread on a sandwich it's not gonna taste nice it's gonna be the same thing it's not the same thing this thing is filthy it's still dirty it's old it's molded you cannot put it on a sandwich you are right Clarissa is right. And the same with the sandwich. Mold and fresh. You cannot mix it. The same with the sandwich. We cannot expect that our sins, when we commit sin, that we are still going to go to heaven. Yes. We cannot. Never mind how small, never mind how big the sin is. You cannot expect that God is just going to send you to heaven. Because we need to ask for forgiveness. First of all, we need to repent. Mm -hmm. Our sins, we need to repent and we need to ask for forgiveness. And isn't it just amazing, Clarissa, did you know? It's actually so cool. God is actually so cool. Yes. He sent one amazing person to earth to forgive us our sins. Yes. He gave the, his most precious thing to us so that we so that our sins can be forgiven. That's amazing. Don't you think? That is super amazing. Yes. Yeah. And we need to abide. We need to we need to listen. We need to actually know and we need to be aware of what we do every single day. Yes. Because you can easily, easily, easily go astray. And sometimes we are so used to just being doing that we don't realize that we're committing sin. Yeah. So we need to be aware of what we are doing every single day. And it's like the Bible says, do 
as if you were Jesus and God. Love as if you are them. Love like them. Yes. For them, like them, yes. with them, in, out, everywhere. Like what's in Bible verse? What's in Bible verse? John 3 verse 16. There we go. Yes. There we go. Yes. And it says, it says, God so gave his only son for our sins, for those who believe in him will not perish, but will have everlasting life. Everlasting life, guys. That is what we need to work towards. Everlasting life. Yes. So, remember, sin is not good. Yeah. We are still human, but try your best to repent, ask for forgiveness, and be thankful. Yes. So, kids, today we are learning how to act out John 3 verse 16. So, get up. Get on your feet, get loose so that we can learn this together. And it says, John 3 verse 16, and it says, God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son for whoever believes in him that they shall not perish but have eternal life. How cool is that? Okay, one more time. It says, John 3, verse 16. It says, God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son for whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. Wow, girls, I'm so happy that you told me that I cannot mix moldy bread with fresh bread. Yes. So, kids, we want to ask you today, do you want to be a fresh bread or a moldy bread? Yes. If you want to be a fresh bread today, ask for forgiveness. Give your heart to Jesus and he will wash you clean. Everybody that believes in him, will ever have everlasting life just sit like this let's pray together god thank you so much for sending your son jesus to die for us that he can wash away our sins yes. that we can repent and be close to you and your heart we as children of god want to want to pray praise and honor your name in Jesus' name, Amen. Can I get an Amen? Amen. Who are we? Children of God. And what are we? Blessed. Bye. John three sixteen. For God so loved the world, the whole world, everyone, anyone, that a lot of people, that He gave His one and only Son. His only son that whoever believes in him will not perish but have eternal life